they don't like you speaking your truth. They do not deny your truth because your truth contradicts the lies that they tell themselves. They hate that you have gone no contact with that parent, with that family member, with that relative, because it makes it very real and salient how abusive that family member or that relative is. They can't continue to live the lie as if they were a good parent or a good grandparent or a good sibling or a good cousin. But for someone to have gone no contact with them, it clearly shows the abuse that that person, that abuser, that family member has put others through. It clearly shows the abuser that they are. And it shows the abuse that they have put others through. We cannot deny the abuse any longer. What it does is it makes the reality come to the surface. They have to face the reality that they are avoiding. They deep down understand why people have found no contact with them, but their ego wants to protect themselves, protect what they have experienced, and protect the abuser because they have not healed from what their abuser has put them through. So to acknowledge that their abuser is abusing somebody else, they have to also acknowledge that they themselves have been abused. And when they're not ready to do that, they deny everybody that speaks up and exposes the abuser. Because they haven't healed their wounds and they haven't dealt with their past, they want to just deny everybody else's reality. But if your truth and your presence makes them face their past. Keep speaking your truth.